What is an ectopic pregnancy? Pregnancy begins with a fertilized egg. Normally, the fertilized egg attaches to the lining of the uterus. An ectopic pregnancy occurs when a fertilized egg implants and grows outside the main cavity of the uterus. An ectopic pregnancy most often occurs in a fallopian tube, which carries eggs from the ovaries to the uterus. This type of ectopic pregnancy is called a tubal pregnancy. Sometimes, an ectopic pregnancy occurs in other areas of the body, such as the ovary, abdominal cavity or the lower part of the uterus, cervix, which connects to the vagina. An ectopic pregnancy can't proceed normally. The fertilized egg can survive, and the growing tissue may cause life-threatening bleeding, if left untreated. Symptoms You may not notice any symptoms at first. However, some women who have an ectopic pregnancy have the usual early signs or symptoms of pregnancy, a missed period, breast tenderness and nausea. If you take a pregnancy test, the result will be positive. Still, an ectopic pregnancy can't continue as normal. As the fertilized egg grows in the improper place, signs and symptoms become more noticeable. Early warning of ectopic pregnancy Often, the first warning signs of an ectopic pregnancy are light vaginal bleeding and pelvic pain. If blood leaks from the fallopian tube, you may feel shoulder pain or an urge to have a bowel movement. Your specific symptoms depend on where the blood collects and which nerves are irritated. Emergency Symptoms If the fertilized egg continues to grow in the fallopian tube, it can cause the tube to rupture. Heavy bleeding inside the abdomen is likely. Symptoms of this life-threatening event include extreme lightheadedness, fainting and shock, causes. A tubal pregnancy, the most common type of ectopic pregnancy, happens when a fertilized egg gets stuck on its way to the uterus, often because the fallopian tube is damaged by inflammation or is misshapen. Hormonal imbalances or abnormal development of the fertilized egg also might play a role, who is at risk for an ectopic pregnancy. All sexually active women are at some risk for an ectopic pregnancy. Risk factors increase with any of the following. Maternal age of 35 years or older. History of pelvic surgery, abdominal surgery, or multiple abortions. History of pelvic inflammatory disease. PID. History of endometriosis. Conception occurred despite tubal ligation or intrauterine device, IUD. Conception aided by fertility drugs or procedures. Smoking. History of ectopic pregnancy. History of sexually transmitted diseases, STDs, such as gonorrhea or chlamydia. Having structural abnormalities in the fallopian tubes that make it hard for the egg to drave. Complications An ectopic pregnancy can cause your fallopian tube to burst open. Without treatment, the ruptured tube can lead to life-threatening bleeding. Prevention Prediction and prevention aren't possible in every case. You may be able to reduce your risk through good reproductive health maintenance. Have your partner wear a condom during sex and limit your number of sexual partners. This reduces your risk for STDs, which can cause PID, a condition that can cause inflammation in the fallopian tubes. Maintain regular visits with your doctor, including regular gynecological exams and regular STD screenings. Taking steps to improve your personal health, such as quitting smoking is also a good preventive strategy. Diagnosis A pelvic exam can help your doctor identify areas of pain, tenderness, or a mass in the fallopian tube or ovary. However, your doctor can't diagnose an ectopic pregnancy by examining you. You'll need blood tests and an ultrasound. Ultrasound A transvaginal ultrasound allows your doctor to see the exact location of your pregnancy. For this test, a wand-like device is placed into your vagina. It uses sound waves to create images of your uterus, ovaries and fallopian tubes, and sends the pictures to a nearby monitor. 
abdominal ultrasound, in which an ultrasound one is moved over your belly, may be used to confirm your pregnancy or evaluate for internal bleeding. Treatment A fertilized egg can develop normally outside the uterus. To prevent life-threatening complications, the ectopic tissue needs to be removed. Depending on your symptoms and when the ectopic pregnancy is discovered, this may be done using medication, laparoscopic surgery or abdominal surgery. Medication Your doctor may decide that immediate complications are unlikely. In this case, your doctor can prescribe several medications that could keep the ectopic mass from bursting. According to the app, one common medication for this is methotrexate, rheumatrex. Methotrexate is a drug that stops the growth of rapidly dividing cells, such as the cells of the ectopic mass. If you take this medication, your doctor will give it to you as an injection. You should also get regular blood tests to ensure that the drug is effective. When effective, the medication will cause symptoms that are similar to that of a miscarriage. These include Cramping Bleeding The passing of tissue Emergency surgery If the ectopic pregnancy is causing heavy bleeding, you might need emergency surgery. This can be done laparoscopically or through an abdominal incision laparotomy. In some cases, the fallopian tube can be saved. Typically, however, a ruptured tube must be removed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.